Now to boys basketball, Faribault in town to take on the Mayo Spartans on senior night. Andre Crockett Jr. came out firing in this one. First half, Spartans down three. AC fires a three ball in from the corner to tie the game. Later in the half, the Falcons took the lead. Alex Leet finds John Palmer open beyond the arc. That's buckets. Faribault now up one. A few possessions later, Mayo had the answer. McQuee Reek gives it to Michael Sharp, who takes it all the way to the rack. Then later, how about another three ball from Crockett? The senior trails the play, then drills the triple. Mayo blows out Faribault 78 to 44. Across town, John Marshall playing their first game since February 8th, taking on the Winona Windhawks. Second half, Windhawks up eight, but they push the lead to double digits. Shane Sharmock finds Jacob Miller, Winona. Now up 10. Later in the half, Winona now up five. Sharmock hits Max Maxwell, who connects from long distance. Windhawks up eight, but JM would try to get back in the game. The Rockets push the pace. It's Tyler Smith who gets the bucket plus the foul, but Winona was too good in this one. Andrew Grafton sinks a three ball. John Marshall falls to Winona 58 to 41. Lastly, the new AP rankings came out for high school basketball today in AAA. The Austin Packers remained ranked number 10 in the state, while Caledonia and Stewartville remain at 3-4 and four in the AA poll. Caledonia and Stewartville have been top five teams all season long. On the girls' side, the Mayo Spartans continue to rise. This week, they check in at number six in the 4A poll. Mayo is 11-0 this season. In AAA, Mankato West remains ranked seventh. In AA, the undefeated Stewartville Tigers remain ranked number six, while WEM moves down to number nine in the single-A poll.